Hello and welcome back to another Big Owls Big Workout video and today is all about bench press which you've seen me do before but it's a slightly different workout this time and I do actually throw in at the end a wee bit of triceps also. Now I don't really respect triceps, I've always had a very strong triceps naturally since, well, since I can remember basically. I've always had to train minimum to develop strength and develop them in, in well, size and everything so as a result as I saw it's a touch of arrogance I rarely train them but this is one of the few occasions you actually see me do a little bit of triceps and I mean a little bit it's a tiny little workout and you see just how much I disrespect them because I just blast straight through it but to start off with as you guys know I'm a big believer in cardiovascular fitness um, especially explosive burst fitness that kind of fitness that you develop on rowing you can see me rowing here um, now the row that I'm doing today is about 90% pace, I'm not putting 100% effort in um, because obviously it's a warm up and if I was to put 100% effort in I would be completely knackered and unable to do a reasonable weight workout but I still wanted to tie myself up a little bit and warm my joints up and warm my head up as well, I actually went to this workout today not wanting to train so this is my way of kind of switching myself on so to speak yeah. Now, I'm doing 500 meter sprint on the rower, and I pull a 132.8, which is a very fast time, especially seeing I'm not putting maximum effort in. My personal best is 1 minute 28, so you can see that I'm about 4, nearly 5 seconds behind my fastest pace, but it's still a quick pace, guys. If you go on the row, if you've not tried this before, put 500 meter interval in and just see what pace you can get, and you'll see 132.8 is a really good time. Um, and it's a, especially for a warm up as I, as I stress again this is just a warm up guys so this is not me putting 100% effort in there you go I'll finish I'm just put, doing a few lazy pulls at the end just to try and let my heart slow down I do go from rowing onto the treadmill but I didn't film that because I don't really see the point of fi tr filming 5 minutes of me walking on a treadmill at a very slow pace I just do that to let my heart calm down but here's proof of the time there we go 132.8 and now we move on to the actual workout proper itself which is of course like I mentioned earlier bench press and on the bar at the moment we have 70 kilograms um, which is oh, I can't do the maths on that one let's have a think it's about 140 uh, 155 pounds roughly it's a light weight and it's treated like a lightweight. As you can see, I am pause repping the 70 kilograms for three easy reps. I pause rep um, because one, it's a good way of developing your technique when you're a beginner. But when you're more advanced like myself, it's a nice way of stretching your muscles off whilst warming up. And on higher weights, it's a fantastic way of actually developing very strong, deep uh, muscle fibers, the kind of muscle fibers you wouldn't normally develop when you're just simply lifting the weight. On the bar at the moment, 100, kilo, 100 kilograms, 220 pounds, handled very easily. That's my last warm-up. There's not much point doing a lot of warm-up today on bench press because, of course, well, I warmed up with my rowing, so my, I'm pretty supple at this point. 140 kilograms on the bar now, that's 310 pounds. And uh, this is my first working weight. I don't go any heavier than this today, but I do increase the reps every set. So one rep for my first set. Second set will be two reps, and the third set, as you'll see, will be three reps. This is my second set. I did have a spot offer me, uh, offered to me, so I thought I might as well take it just in case I fail. Because, you know, I know I'm not going to fail 140 for two, but I might fail 140 for three. But, you know, 310 pounds, if I was to drop that on me, it, it would it would do more than just hurt yeah so it's always nice and always good to have a spot and if it's offered to me i might as well take it yeah so this is my third and final set 140 kilograms 310 pounds three nice easy reps and you'll see just how easy they are some of you might say well it's so easy why don't you do more al you know well the answer is because i want to in a light face workouts i walk into the gym and i crawl out i'm knackered by the end of a light face workout but in a heavy face workout which is i'm I'm at the end of my heavy face now I always believe that you should walk out with enough energy to grow that's the whole point so I walk out fresh here we go a nice easy tricep workout I just pulled whatever weight was already on there so this is the weight that the previous person used it's way too light I know it's too light guys and as you see I get get sick and bored so instead of like having a proper rest period in between every set I decide actually to have no rest 
and you'll see basically it's one long set this even though it's essentially four sets put together I have about three seconds rest in between each set um, I actually end up lifting the full stack the last uh, weight that you'll see me lift is the complete whole stack of weight so literally I cannot make this any heavier and you'll see just how easily I handle it and as a result you'll see why I just disrespect triceps so much there's just not that much point me putting significant effort into it um, for the purposes that I'm, I'm using them, you know, what I train for, you know. If I was a bodybuilder and I wanted to develop the aesthetic of the muscle, how yeah, I'd be training triceps a lot more because I need to shape the muscles. But if I'm just looking at strength and I've already got it, what's the point in putting time on triceps when I can be putting it on muscle groups that are a little bit weaker on me? You know, if I take time away from triceps and put it towards another muscle group, I'm going to benefit a lot more from that. Yeah, that's my understanding anyway. Thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you very soon. Thank you.